Hey, what's going on you guys? It's your boy Redstone Knights here. Welcome back to another mod showcase video. Now today's video, I'm going to be showcasing you guys a small mod that would allow you to take flight in the skies. And this is something somewhat of an upgrade slash maybe downgrade version of the uh, of the Elytra wings here, depending on how you use them in Minecraft. Now, before I get into what they are and how they work, guys, as always, make sure you guys hit that like button and subscribe, and turn on notifications so you won't miss a video. Apart from that, guys, let's begin today's video. Okay, guys, so the mod we're messing with today is the Wings mod, 1.12.2. And as always, the link for this mod will be in the description down below if you guys want to try it out for yourself. Now, let's start the video. So first off, we need to go over some of the crafting recipes here. And as you can see, these are all the wings you've got here. So we've got angel wings, blue butterfly wings, evil wings, fire wings, slime wings, bat wings, dragon wings, fairy wings, and monarch butterfly wings. And don't worry, I will showcase all of them and how they work. But they all do the same thing. So how to craft them. So first off, to make the angel wings, you're going to need gold, one diamond, and two feathers, and then one fairy dust. And actually, this is one of the new items, so you're probably wondering, how do you get fairy dust? And there's also a new item here called amethyst. So, if we come over here, these two ores can be found in cave systems, and the amethyst right here is just as rare as diamond. So you basically mine them with the pickaxe right here to get the fairy dust. And these are crucial to making the wings that I've shown you in the chest. Keep that in mind. And then this is what amethyst looks like. It kind of looks like an emerald, low key. But yeah, that's how you can get these. Just go into a cave and find them. I'll get into I'll get into what's that over there later. So for the angel wings, like I said, four gold like this, a diamond, feathers, and a fairy dust. For the blue butterfly wings, you need lapis and an ink sack, and then the same thing. And actually, all these recipes are going to include gold and one diamond, so keep that in mind. So, for the evil wings, this one you need, same thing, four gold and a diamond, and one fairy dust. But this time you need an emerald and amethyst to make the evil wings. For the fire wings, same recipes except use time. On the two sides of the diamond, you need blaze powder to get the fire wings. For the slime wings, same thing, but you just need two slime balls on up the opposite sides of the diamond. Now for the bat wings, same recipe, but this time you need bat blood. For the bat wings. And I'm going to show you right now how you can get it. So, if we come over here, I made this little bat cage to contain some of the bats. So, let's go in here. So, what you need to do, guys, is just get an empty glass bottle and hopefully they'll hold still. You just need to right click with the bat to get bat blood. And apparent, and also when you right click them, it actually doesn't harm them. Thing. So you can pretty much spam this as many times as you want. And this does stack up like normal blocks would, so keep that in mind. So that's how you get bat, bat blood and how you can use them to make the bat wings. Now for the dragon wings, this one may involve you to go to the end for that because you need to go near the ender dragon or probably defeat it well. You don't really need to defeat the air dragon, you just need to get an empty glass bottle and same thing, you just need to scoop up its dragon breath to to get the dragon's breath right here, to put that in the recipe to get dragon wings. So that one might be a little tougher to get, because you need two of those. And now for the fairy wings, this one's a little bit easier. Again, same recipe, except you need like pink tulip and oxide daisy. I'm not sure if you need to have those specific flowers. I think it could be any flower, honestly, for the fairy wings. And lastly, the monarch butterfly wings. You need four gold, 
a diamond, fairy dust, and then ink sack, but this time instead of lapis, you need orange dye for these wings. Okay, so now that I show you all that, let me put these away. And let's get out all these wings right here. So let me go into create. Actually, no, we'll start out here first before we go up there. So this, you just need to right click to put this on your chest plate spot. And to fly, you need to press your default key, R, to fly. So when you press R, you're able to get in this mode. And look, now you're taking flight. And how you control yourself is to move in the direction your mouse is facing. And you can use your sprint key to speed up. And then S to slow down. So these are the angel wings. And to get out of flight mode, you need to press R again. And then you'll float safely back down to the ground. So those are the angel wings. And then the monarch, sorry, not monarch, blue butterfly wings. Press R. And you can tell that they're unique because with these kind of wings, they actually flap a lot faster. And also you move at the same speed, so it doesn't matter what wings you wear. Hold on, let me eat some food. And let's put on the evil wings while I explain something very important, guys. Hold on, let me get this out of my inventory. And this is very important to know, guys. So when you... F Hold on, let me get out... So when you fly, like as you're flying around, say I'm casually flying in the air, minding my own business. Just need to wait to fly around a lot. So they are good for, for getting around places and also making good land. Try away until it's see what happens. Oh, it's starting to happen. So as you can see, my hunger bar is starting to go down. So even though you're able to fly around and craft these wings in the overworld, which is pretty great, I must say, but there's a catch. Apparently, every time you fly with your wings, it actually reduces your hunger bar very quickly. Your hunger bar, your hunger bar gets consumed very easily. And as you can see, since my hunger bar stopped when it got to the third hung three hunger points left, it actually stopped me in mid-air. So that is very important to know. Always have food with you when you fly. Otherwise, you'll be forced to take an emergency landing. Well, you won't die from falling, but still. Your hunger bar will get consumed very quick if you... Just keep flying for long distances. Unless you have food, then you can stay in the air. Okay, so let's go back down and test out the other wings. So next we got bat wings. Very nice. They, kind of, they look very similar to an actual bat. I'm trying to get out of this hole right here. So very nice. Oops. Actually, if you take the map of your inventory, then you will fall. I should probably should press R. Okay, never mind that. So let's take these off, and now we're on to Dragon Wings. So that's how the Dragon Wings look. Press R. And now, moving on to the Fairy Wings. So I'm putting all these on so you know how each one will look and how each one would perform while flying. So these are the fairy wings. Oh, should be some steak. And lastly, we've got the monarch butterfly wings. Also very nice right here. Just flying around casually. And now let's press R to get back to land. So those are all the wings. And also another thing to know that they do have durability. Uh, so I believe the most... The wings that will last the longest 
are the Dragon Wings right here, because they have over 2,000 durability. And before I get into what's that over there, there's also another thing I want you to know about the Fairy Dust right here. You can actually repair- <laughs> Well, didn't, didn't it see that coming. But anyway, as I was saying, if your wings are damaged, you can actually repair, you can actually repair your wings with fairy dust in an anvil. When you do that, look at that, your wings are repaired. So it's like the elytra wings that you need to use leather to repair them. So with these kind of wings, you need fairy dust to repair them with the anvil. And that's the basics of the wing. So let's go back up there and, and I'll show you what I had in store up there. I'll just get on any... I'm just trying to get on any kind of wing so I can get up. Okay, so... What I had over here is that this is my way of testing how fast these wings are compared to the Elytra wings. Hold on, let me quickly give myself some fireworks. Okay, so we're gonna do a couple of speed runs with these wings and then with the Elytra one, see what's faster. And then you guys can comment down below which do you think is better, the wings or the Elytra wings. So, we're gonna start off with these dragon wings right here. Always have food with you guys. Okay, pretty nice. And then you can always use R, S to slow down, and then press R to... Oops. That was too early, the landing. Okay, there we go. Sorry, guys. And now let's get on this platform, back to where we were, and now we're gonna do the Elytra Wing. So put these in my inventory. Should probably get back up there. And three, two, one, go. So the Elytra wings are pretty fast when you have fireworks. And you are able to control your gliding skills, no problem. But the downside is you need to work very hard to defeat the ender dragon so that way you have access to go going into the end city well going to the portal to the other parts of the end to find the end city but at finding the end city could take hours to find and i and i know that some of you minecrafters out there would probably have a hard time trying to find the end city well i guess it just depends on luck and where you walk to Still, they are hard to find and you have to face a bunch of chokers and other nasty that guard the engine. But on the plus side with the wings, you, you can just craft them here and then all the resources you need to craft them are in the overworld. Oh, and I just realized I forgot to test out the fire wings. So yeah, these are the fire wings. I'd say these, I'd say these look very good. Right here, but yeah, as I was saying, all the resources you need to make these wings are right here in the overworld and in the cave systems. But again, I can argue for both sides, they're both pretty great for high maneuver flying, so... Let me know in the comments what you guys think is, is better. And also comment down below what's your favorite wing wings out of this mod pack that you think were the best. And also, these are the slime wings. Sorry guys, I just realized I didn't test it yet. Oops. Press R. What are you doing? Oh, there we go. But again, yeah. Comment down below what's your favorite wings. And yeah, that is pretty much the wings mod in Minecraft 1.12.2. And that is gonna wrap up for today's video, guys. If you guys enjoyed this video and want to see more videos like this, make sure you guys hit that like button and subscribe. Thank <laughs> you.
turn on notifications so you won't miss a video. Apart from that, guys, thanks for watching this video, and I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.